sure you parked the truck mobile down here. Certainly. It was on the corner by the post office. Oh, no, it was the other way. Yeah. Hey. Oh! Oh, my nose! Oh, me comic. My goodness. There you go. Oh, thank you very much. No problem. No harm done, that. I'm sure. <laughs> well, I'd better be off. Honestly, what were you thinking about? I'm thinking I can't make head and tail of your comic. Well, let's... Hang on, this is not my comic. They're hieroglyphics, ancient Egyptian writing. That lady must have dropped it. We'd better take it back to the museum, then. Don't be silly, she's not that old. No, the hieroglyphics, that's where they're from. Look at the stamp. Hey, it's a good job I noticed that. We could have been here all day. Come on. No, don't go! Come back! What have you got here? What? Oh, sorry, I was talking to the security guards. Oh, what were they guarding? Not much by the look of it. Well, they were supposed to be guarding this. The fabulous Ankh of Tutankhamun. It's worth millions, you know. Is that it, then? Yes, it's an Egyptian cross. I made an Egyptian cross once. Really? I stood on his foot. Look, can I help you, or are you just here to waste my time? Well, we're looking for the head of the museum. Uh, I am the director. In that case, do you think you could direct us to the head of the museum? I am the head of the museum. Well, why didn't you say so? We've come to return these hieroglyphics of yours. <laughs> Security beams. Oh. <laughs> so, hieroglyphics. Very interesting. Very interesting indeed. Can you translate them, then? Uh, yes. Yes, I'm sure I can. In fact, I'll close up the museum straight away and have a look at them. Hang on, you can't close up the museum. What about the ank? You can't leave it unguarded. Well, I... Hey, I tell you what. We could guard it for you. We're good at guarding things. We guarded next door's tortoise once. It ran away. Yes, yes, but we also looked after Dan the Rand's gran. She turned up three weeks later in Frinton. And once we guarded the Bank of England. Yeah, they're letting us pay the 50 billion back in weekly instalments. Yeah, but apart from the tortoise and Dan the Van's gran and the bank, nothing goes missing when we're looking after it. No, it just goes missing when we pop out for a cup of tea. Well, uh, I don't know quite what to say. Of course, I haven't told you about the Mummy's Curse. Mummy's Curse? You see, 5,000 years ago, King Tutankhamun was buried with his fabulous ankh, and he must never be parted from it. It is said that every night the king wanders the corridors of the museum to safeguard his most precious treasure. That's why the security guards ran away. It's been very nice meeting you. See you later. <laughs> Don't you worry. The museum's in safe hands. Yes, yeah, just our arms, legs and feet that let us down. Actually, you know, you two might be just right for the job. You can rely on us. Remember the old chuckle motto? Don't do that. That's it. King Tutankhamun's in there. Not even I'm allowed to touch it. Really? Well, how would anybody know? Because the whole museum is covered by security cameras. Ah, oh, I see. Well, I'm going to head off and have a look at these hieroglyphics of yours. I'm sure you two will do an unbelievable job of looking after the ank. Yes, well, don't worry about a thing. We'll just check that everything's in order. What are you doing? This is the mummy case, right? You know it is. In that case, where's the mummy? In that case. In that case, we've got a problem. No, 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 no. In that case, we've got a mummy. In that case, we've got nothing. What are you talking about? Let's have a look. Just in case. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Lost King Tutin coming. What's the director going to think? We've only had the job two minutes and already you've lost his mummy. What are we going to do? Maybe nobody will notice. What about the security cameras? Oh, dear, oh, dear. I forgot about those. We're going to have to replace the mummy. Where are we going to find an Egyptian mummy at this time of night? It doesn't have to be a real one, does it? Just something human-shaped. Now you're talking. Something about... Oh, let's see. Um, about this height, I would say. Exactly, that's just <laughs> what we... Hang on a minute. There's nothing to worry about, just a few bandages. There must be a first aid kit around somewhere. Really? Hmm. It's all to do with health and safety. Your health and safety, you mean? Hmm. Off you go, then. Haven't you got a torch or anything? Oh, here you are. There you go. Right. It's not very bright. That makes two of you. It's in a bit. <laughs> Barry, that was quick. 
<laughs> all right, all right, no need to overdo it. Now, come on, let's get you inside here. Hey, stop struggling, stop struggling, get in there. Come on, in you go. Get in there. That's it. Oh, so sorry. Hang on a sec. I thought so. <laughs> the mummy. All right. What are you messing about at? Get back in that case. What do you mean? Back in there. I've not been in there. Oh, no. I suppose you've not even had your costume on yet, have you? No, it's in the toilet. And you are in there. Oh, no, I'm not. Oh, yes, you are. Look. See? I'm not in there. Well, I can see that. Get your costume back on. It's with the real mummy. The real mummy? In the toilet. Well, what's he doing in there? Well, it's no good in there, is it? It needs to be back in here. He's in there. Get him out, then. No fear. Well, if there's no fear, what's stopping you? Quite right. See? Nothing to worry about. Come on, let's get back where it belongs. We'll never get to Egypt from back in the night. Yeah, get off, mate. Steady, steady. Steady, steady. Come on, come on. Right, come on. Steady, steady. To you. Steady. To you. Steady, steady. To me. To you. To you, buddy. Steady. Steady now. To you, To you, buddy. Steady. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? We're just taking the mummy back to where it belongs. <laughs> the director of the museum's asked us to help out. You two? Yes, and we've only lost one mummy so far. <laughs> I can see why the director thinks you're ideal for the job. Anyway, what are you doing here? Oh, well, it's obvious, isn't it? She's here to do her Egyptological research. I am? Oh, yes, you can't fool us. We found your hieroglyphics. What? But don't worry, we've given them to the director. He's taken them home to translate them. Has he now? Well, I suppose I'd better get on with my research. I'm sure I'll be bumping into you two later. Phew, I thought you'd see the mummy then. Come on, let's get back to its case. What is that? Let's go and have a look. <laughs> it's just an owl. Oh. 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 oh! oh! Dear, oh dear. Seems to have gained a few pounds. Perhaps he can give you some tips for your investments. No, wait. Wait here. I'd sooner come with you. Come on, then. Do you know? Okay, then. Come on. Me. Well done, you. Thanks very much. You're welcome. There we go. <laughs> right, what next? I think I'll check the alarm system out. How will you know if it's working? Well, I know more about alarm systems than I know about hieroglyphics. Oh, dear. Do I have to come as well? No, no, no. You're all right, Barry. You stay here with the mummy. All on your own. <sighs> on second thoughts, you could do with a hand, couldn't you? Right, let's see if we're alarmed, then. Alarmed? I'm scared out my wits. Call that an alarm system? It's an alarm system. Not much of one. Here, pass me a screwdriver. Thanks. Here you go. Thanks. Paul, Paul, Paul. Not now, I'm busy. Too busy to thank our friend, here. Oh, no, I'm never too busy for that. A chuckle's always polite. Ah! Have we lost it? I think so. Ah! Ah! Oh, This is ridiculous. We can't run around here all night. Well, can we run around here all day? It's a bit less scary. You're right. Let's go home. Hey, what about the lady? We can't leave her in there alone. I suppose you're right. Chuck us to the rescue. Go on, after you. Hey. Oh, glad to see you're OK. Do you know, there's mummies running around all over the place. Really? Doesn't it worry you? It scares me stiff. Not you, her. Oh, no, mummies don't scare me. Really? Really. 
Now then, I think I'd better be getting back to work. I'm sure I'll see you later. Excuse me? Oh, certainly. <laughs> see, Barry, you should be more like her. She's not afraid to be alone with her mummy. She's not alone. There's us. And the fabulous Hank. I wonder why she was looking at it. Well, she's doing her Egyptian research, isn't she? Ah, so that's why she had the bandage in her pocket. Oh, yes. Either that or she's been dressing up as a mummy. Well, why would she want to do that? She'd frighten everybody away. Leaving her alone with the Hank. Which is worth millions. How clever of me. She's obviously planning to scare us off so she can steal the Hank. But we're going to put a stop to that. You're going to give her a taste of her own medicine. Is she a doctor as well as a thief, then? No, 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 no. You're going to scare her away using your mummy disguise. Me? Why can't you do it? Cos I'll be setting a trap for her. Off you go. I wonder if there's any tools anywhere. The mummy's coming. Oh. Very funny. No, the real mummy's coming. Excellent. Off you go, then. Lure her towards the trap. Oh. Right. Just one final adjustment. Is it her? No, it's my thumb. Your thumb's nothing to shout about. Don't just stand there. Get me a bandage. I can't. I've used them all for this disguise. Uh... I've got some. Well, hurry up. Hang on, I want me a sec. Almost there. I've got her. Then why is she over there? Inspector Cleo Ford of The Yard. Shouldn't that be me, Ted? You were a policeman? We thought you were the mummy. You had those hieroglyphics. Hieroglyphics? Those were the security plans. I was supposed to check them. And the bandages? Evidence. I found them near the ankh. It was obvious that someone was dressing up as the mummy. Well, if you're not the mummy, it must be... The director. the director! Yes, and I would have gotten away with it too. Oh, no, you wouldn't. How do you know? He'd never have got past my mummy trap. Watch. See? I tell you what, we could look after it for you. We're good at guarding things. We goaded. We goaded. We did. Go She's not afraid to be alone with her mummy. She's not alone. There's us. And the fabulous Hank. The what? Fabulous Hank. <laughs> She's obviously trying to frighten us off so she can steal the Hank. Don't smile. What's the matter? <laughs> You've got a grin on your face oh, yeah. while you were doing it's it. Because I'm happy. Oh. <laughs> 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 <laughs>